is up, everybody? Crypto Muscle. Coming to you with another YouTube video. Oh, yeah. By the way, it is Sunday. Sunday morning. Well, the timing of this video is Sunday morning. Ah, you know what? It's almost afternoon. I'll just say Sunday afternoon. Here. In my office. My desk. That I'm sitting at. Purple Sundays as well. It's always going to be Purple Tuesdays. Oh yeah, and it's big girthy Tuesdays, you know, when that day comes because of the fact it's max pull out. But today is Sunday. A lot of things going on this weekend, being that it's Sunday. We have Valentine's Day. We have President's Day weekend here, which is tomorrow. And then what else is going on? And those, and those of you that are uh, Asian out there, having. Lunar New Year as well. It's a big time weekend for the Asians out there. And so, a lot of stuff going on this weekend. And Cuba Tech is always going to be purpley as we drink the purple stuff. Man, oh man, this thing is going to continue to just slay the scene. And knock down the green giant so the question is asked what would be the best one to go into today would it be cash of x or would it be cubatech well let's look at real quickly cash effects all right so they've been around for over a year now uh coming up a year and a half if you include pre-launch then um they've been around a year and a half plus and they're still doing fine and everything. They're still running. Um, you know, haven't missed any withdrawals. Things like that. Things are good still. But things just haven't made any progress over there. And that's the reason why I chose not to continue on in cash effects. Because things are just not happening anymore over there like it used to be. The people, the big wigs behind it are not as active the faces that you would see behind cash effects um, are just not what it used to be whereas cubatech they're constantly showing the faces of them i mean pff, you go down to the ceo here doing webinars every friday letting everybody know what's going on with cubatech what's happening just filling in, you know, just everything that's happening behind the scenes, just news without, you know, throughout the week, updates, just everything going on. He's constantly there every week. When's the last time you heard from Huascar Lopez of Cash Effects at the launch, New Year's uh, anniversary, uh, launch, not New Year's, but launch anniversary, November last year? And then before that, how often did you see him then? once in a blue moon yeah i get it they're busy and all that but still the big difference between this this team of people here that's constantly you know putting out there showing their faces just providing information whereas cash of x you barely see any of the top people anymore but let alone you barely saw them in the first place uh probably if anybody back then it would be like Justin Holiday, Luigi Bruni, but even that you don't even you hardly ever see them anymore. They they've become less and less of a presence in the space. I mean, for that platform. And so you know, it, it got me thinking. So of course, Cubatech is newer, right? So already off the bat, that's two things right there. One, Cubatech is newer, so this would be the better opportunity to join in and jump on board and continue to be part of the growth that's happening, all right? Two, the faces behind the platform, there's, it's more ever so present with Greg Lamone weekly. You never got a weekly thing with Huascar Lopez at all, ever. And uh, like I said, the only probably top person that you would see from Cash of X, if anything, back then, 
is Justin Holiday. But other than that, you don't really see anybody anymore. And so, what do they got going on here at Cuba Tech? They got a lot of stuff going on. A lot of things that could appeal to everybody. All right. Whereas Catch of X, you only have one thing, right? Which is the Academy Packs, which is equivalent to like this digital license. Other than that, what else do they have? I mean, copy trading hasn't really proven anything so far. It's supposed to be something of a new product that's still in beta, though. And they're just really dragging this beta thing out. And so far, mixed results. But then when you look at what Cash of X can provide, they have a trading bot here that could pretty much be the filler for that copy trading that Cash of X is doing. So here at Cubitech, you already have a win right here. And one thing about it too is that you don't have to have, you know, five thousand dollars. Originally that's what they said you needed five thousand to open up copy trading if you're eligible because you have to be in an eligible country to do it. And now they lower the minimum instead of five thousand, I think. I think the entry is now a thousand for the moment. As they're trying to test things out. Um mixed results trading. Whereas here, you don't need to do that. If you really want some sort of trading going on with, say, like, copy trading, trading bots, and all that, might as well just go into this one. And you don't need to open up a separate line or pay a separate fee for this. Because if you already pay a $1,000 and up on a digital license, you're already ahead of the game, and the bot comes in for free. So rather than trying to you know, play with copy trading, the, these trading bots can do the work for you and complement you on your earnings with your digital license. So that's already another win once again for Cash FX. But I mean, for uh, Cubatech, sorry, for the Cubatech team. So that's three, three to zero right now. Now we could go on. What else does Cash FX have besides the Academy Pack and the copy trading? Let's think about it for a second here. Well, that's all we need is a second because there's nothing else. Nothing else from Cash of X that can help you, can benefit you. What other products do they have? They have nothing. I mean, they got their store, I guess, if, you want, if you're talking about products. A power team store. Ooh, uh, you know, don't bust me up. So when you look at what Cubatech has, they have other stuff going on. They got a cashback license. If you're looking for cash back on your purchases, boom. They have a corporate license. If you're trying to buy a house or a car or save money on traveling, they have a corporate license for you. You know, Queen Wiki did a video the other day, and she put in $40,000 on a corporate license. And with the $40,000, once it runs to full cycle, all right, you that would become $100,000. And she just ended her cycle of the corporate license to purchase a car because she talked about wanting to ride in luxury, right? Ride in a, a new whip, you know, an Escalade, right? So when you look at that, $100,000 to put into an Escalade and it came to fruition because the cycle ended on a corporate license. I'm on my way there as well, which I'll show you in a second. Um, so there's another two more winners on top of what Cash Effects has, which is nothing else. I mean, they're, these guys are trying to help you with making passive income. If you like playing with bots, you can play with bots for additional passive income. If you want cash back on your purchases, cash back on your purchases right here. And if you're trying to buy a car, house, or travel with a big, steep discount, I mean, you're paying, think about it for a second, Queen Wiki, all right? Uh, she's paying only $40,000 for a $100,000 car. You know, and that's what that's about here. And I myself is going to be paying 10000 for a $25,000 car. And I'm not looking to go big or, or, you know, be like some baller or anything like that. There's a particular car I'm looking for, and it, it suits what I'm looking for and what I need. And 25000 would definitely fit the bill for a new uh, newer car that I'm looking for. So when you look at that, what else does Cash of X have? Really nothing. I mean, look at what else that Cubitech has. They do these base camps. They got 
I mean, look at all these servers. They have signals. Does Cache OS have signals? No. Do they have, you know, do they have all this stuff coming up? No. Network travel. Do they, does Cache OS even do that? No. I mean, there's a lot of no's and a lot of yeses. No's to Cache of X and yeses to P, to uh, Cubitech, right? So when you look at it, what, I mean, look at all this. They have all this stuff going on. Look, they even added something new here. This uh, Istanbul Punta, Punta Cana. Special charter flight to the big forum if you want to take that special charter flight. But they got base camps. They got the big forum coming up. Network travels to different places, expeditions, teams, leadership trips, base camps. That's a built, it's about marketing and building up team building and all that and strategy. But you're meeting in person. You do activities together. Cash of X does none of this stuff. They used to meet in person. And yeah, coronavirus did stuff last year. I get it. But they haven't done nothing since. And when you look at what's been going on with Cubatech, a lot more is going on with Cubatech. And by the way, got my additional, you know, I got my $20,000 payout for this week. So be on the lookout once again, Tuesday, max pullout Tuesday. Looking like it might be another 20K pullout once again coming up as this balance is building up. Now, I've already maxed out for the week, so I can't max out again or even withdraw again until uh, Tuesday. Max pull out Tuesdays. Cause I, all right, I'll just show you guys why. Because you only can pull out as much as you have on digital license. So I have a 20,000 digital license because I have two of them. And that adds up to 20. Available transfer is zero. I can't do anything right now until max pull out Tuesdays. And by the way, 2.5% fee. All right, there's, here's another win for you. 2.5% withdrawal fee. That's 17.5% more that you keep in your pocket on withdrawals versus 20% from cash effects. So let's just say this 20K withdrawal that I've been doing for a while. All right, so 20K, 20% of 20k is a huge chunk of money all right that's four thousand dollars they chopping off of you and guys like maddie crypto is okay with that he's okay i'm okay with that because it goes back in the matrix oh it's okay well guys like him are okay with that bloods are okay with that because they did they just love to bleed crypto why would you want to can why would you want to bleed crypto all right and go to places that make you bleed crypto all right when you could be in a place to your advantage right i mean think about it twenty thousand they would have chopped four thousand dollars at week after week after week from me all right look at this week after week i mean that's that's a lot but when you're looking at 20k right and only two and a half percent that's only 500 bucks Wait a second, five hundred dollars versus two thousand dollars, or I mean four thousand? That's just insane. That's crazy. I mean, why would you want to contribute that? That's that's a big difference. Five hundred dollars they're taking away versus four thousand dollars. So I'm keeping thirty five hundred more in my pocket every time I withdraw. So that tells you something. All right, why Cubitech is so much better than cash effects in every way possible all right and plus you know cash effects is on a downward trend whereas cubitech is on the upwards trend and like i said you want to be on a train that's growing and still early this is where it's at right now cubitech versus places like cash effects yeah it's still doing good and all that but it's not doing as good as it used to be and if they keep doing this, it's not going to get any better. It's just going to get, uh, I'm not going to say worse, but it's not going to get any better than better than it is right now. So take advantage of the opportunity Cubitech is presenting to you. All right, just do your research. Check it out. I got links down below for everything I'm in. Building up a massive team of people of winning. And uh, yeah, other than that, 
I'll see you in the next one.